Everybody loves a good box opening video, so in today's video we're going to be checking out the Camwood Bat Weighted Swing Trainer. We're going to open it up, I'm going to give you my initial thoughts on it, we're going to test it out, take some hacks with it, so let's get into it. What's going on guys? If you're new around here, please hit that subscribe button below and click the notification bell so you don't miss out. So if you haven't seen the Camwood Bat Trainer online, it's this weird looking weighted bat trainer that's designed to help you improve your bat speed by 10 miles an hour in as little as two weeks. So let's check it out. already taped up and everything so it says Tony Gwynn eight-time batting champ and Hall of Famer the Camwood bat training has become the preferred training bat of pros and colleges with its perfectly balanced design it allows you to overload in order to build more muscle and bat speed while developing the proper hand pass of the ball thanks for purchasing blah blah blah, blah. the trainer is the only one of its kind and designed in all facets of training including tee work soft toss and live pitching sweet all right, so the one I ordered is a 33 inch. I think it's 44, 45 ounces. Doesn't feel too bad actually. So I'll link Camwood Bat's full explanation video below, but they have all the weight down by your hands, right by the knob here and then right above your hands. Now the thinking or the science behind that is if you picture a sledgehammer and you try to swing it with all the weight at the end of the bat or at the end of the sledgehammer and you try to swing it, it's going to pull you in directions you don't really want to go and you're going to have no control over the bat or the sledgehammer. But if you hold it up by the head of the sledgehammer and try to swing it, it's the same weight but you have a lot more control. So it's the same idea here. All the weight is down by your hands so that when you swing, you have a little bit more control than if all the weight's at the end. So when you buy the bat, they send you a training video of a whole bunch of drills that you can do with this bat. Basically a lot of the drills that you see on this channel just with the cam one bat. So obviously tools like this aren't designed to work in one day, but I'm gonna set up the tee, take some swings, test my velocity, and then I take about 20 swings with this, and then I go back to my regular bat, test my velocity again and see what we see. So let's get into it. So my initial thoughts when swinging this is actually it's not too bad. It's really easy to control. I checked and this is a 33 inch 45 ounce bat so it's about 15 ounces heavier than a regular 33. It's actually pretty easy to control it doesn't feel like 45. I know a lot of weighted bats that you use are end loaded so sometimes depending on how heavy they are when you swing they can kind of feel like they're swinging you but this is really easy to control. So I'm just going to get loose. I'm going to take some swings with my bat measure the velocity and then I'm going to go right into this bat take about 20 to 30 swings with this and then I go right into my bat again and then test the velocity and see if anything changes see what we see like I said before I know these are designed for immediate results but we're just gonna see what we see all right oh gross Set her off nice and easy. So for those of you who follow along, follow us on Instagram. Road to 100 X Velocity program is still happening. We just got something pretty big coming up, so my focus has been on that. Haven't really been able to swing. You guys will find out soon what that is. But I haven't given up. I'm still gonna hit 100. Priorities are just a little bit different right now. Like I said, you guys will find out in a little bit. It's pretty big, we're excited. You know, sometimes I forget to look at the ball when I swing. Lesson number one as a baseball player, always watch the ball. Okay, so I'm starting to feel a little bit loose. I'm gonna take about 10 hard swings with this bat, train with the Camwood Trader for 20 to 30 swings, and then I come back to this one and see what we see. Keep your eye on the ball, dog. It's not even moving. 89. So first round topped out at 89. My highest ever off the tee is 95, but we're obviously not there right now. So now I'm gonna take about 20 to 30 swings with the Camwood bat. Then we're gonna come back to this bad boy and check it out. All right, first swings with this bad boy. See how it feels. Whew. Feels heavy coming off the bat. 
like I said before, when you buy this bat, they give you a kind of a training program, a bunch of drills to do. Don't just buy this and do what I'm doing. Do the drills. This is just for the video. So far, 85 with this one. So my initial overall thoughts on my first round with this thing is, it is easy to swing. You do feel like you have a lot of control over it and you can still feel that it is heavier. So obviously you're getting stronger, the more you use it, faster hands. So now we're gonna go back to my regular bat. Feels a little lighter. So first round highest exit velocity was 89. With the Camwood bat, I hit 85 with that. But now, we're gonna go back to this bat and see what we see. 88. 89. 90. 92. So I'm currently sitting at 92 exit velocity. Feeling 95 coming on. Maybe even a hundy, I don't know. I think I want to play in Toronto. Now we're talking. Oh, that's it. 90. Feeble. 92. Five more daddy hacks. Oh, gross. 347, no. Oh, that's it. 92. Don't think I ate my Wheaties this morning. Okay. 92, 347, we're either hitting 93 or 350 in these next three balls. 92, that's it, I think that's all I have. So my overall initial thoughts on this bat is that I think if you use this consistently on a consistent basis, that I think that it could improve your swing pretty dramatically if you stick with the program. But like I said before, obviously you're not gonna see much difference just using it one time. Today I topped out at 92, 347. Not my best, but, but like I said before, using it one time for 20 minutes is not gonna make a big difference. Once I get a little bit more time, I'm gonna do the actual program that they give you and then I'll give you my full review on that. But I think this is a good tool to use. They also have short bats, single-handed trainers. That'll be beneficial too. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm gonna link Camwood Bats down below, and I'm also gonna link their explanation video to kind of give you the science behind their thinking on the weight being down here. But overall, I recommend this bat. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next week.